求求了，中国学生不要再这么便宜了。我发现了好多中国学生觉得写长句子、写好多从句看起来很牛。No, you're wrong. Long doesn't necessarily mean better. Trust me, I know. 开玩笑的 ，Or am I? Who knows? What? 继续。句子的长度一般不要超过十五到二十个单词。Any longer, and you're likely to make mistakes or confuse the reader. 记住 ，simple and right be complicated and wrong. 好多了。外国老师不吃长难句这一套，那怎么把句子改短呢？先给我点个赞，继续听。D. Full stops are your friends. Break up your sentences. Don't always use commas, and avoid always using and. 第二个 ，remove unnecessary wording. For instance, 不要写 in order to to 就行，除非你字数不够。Don't write as well as and 就行。第三个 ，stop using very. It sounds weak and demonstrates a limited vocabulary. For instance, instead of very important, say crucial. Very good 可以换成 impressive. Very many 可以写 numerous. And another thing, I know this contradicts what I just said, but Don't use contractions. I mean, do not use contractions. See what I did there? So things like can't, won't, gonna, wanna, dung dung. 当然，聊天发信息没问题 ，but they're too informal for academic writing. Also, stop always repeating the same key phrases. Instead of repeatedly using however, use but, yet, nonetheless, dung dung. For example, 可以换成 such as, for instance, to illustrate, dung dung. 最后一个，除了 I think， 可以写 in my opinion, from my perspective, dung dung. But equally, please don't use words that you don't understand. 好多学生想装棒，不想用简单的词。And of course, some students want to avoid repeating the same words. 然后他们就会搜叉叉叉 synonyms， 然后随便选一个单词，结果选了一个不认识，但是看起来很厉害的词。比如你搜 important， you might replace it with importunate， even though you don't know how to use it. 告诉你一个秘密，我也不认识这个词。And the meaning changes completely. 所以不认识的词别乱用。Okay, so how can you actively improve your writing? Skills. Be read. Read anything. Books, articles, journals. Anything will do. The R. Write in a diary. Just make sure your parents don't read it. The Sam. Practice writing essays and get someone to review them. Feedback is key. If you're not sure what to write about, you can search for topics online or see what questions writing competitions set. Biru, are we getting nastier? Does it make sense to hate someone for their opinions? Or should some things be legal to give away but illegal to sell? Biru, your design can be free to send me, but it can't be sold to me. You don't know what I mean. Anyway, you can use these topics to practice. It's not just English language skills you need to consider when writing an essay. Many teachers say greater emphasis is placed on critical thinking in Western education, not merely just remembering things. So lacking critical thinking skills makes writing essays much harder. And if you plan to study abroad in the future, you got to work on it. Anyway, 我发现了好多中国留学生不太会写英语论文。如果大家对这个很感兴趣 ，comment below and let me know. I really hope these tips help, and best of luck with your writing. 记得点赞关注，来直播间学英语。